Hello everyone, and welcome to the Makaya Wealth Building Channel, the place where you learn and become financially free. On today's video we will talk about the psychology of money. We'll be discussing how our beliefs and attitudes about money can affect our financial success, and providing some tips for cultivating a healthy money mindset. There's a famous story about the stock market crash of 1929, which is often attributed to a combination of economic factors and investor panic. However, some historians have argued that a major factor was actually a collective belief in the idea of easy money. The belief was that the stock market was a surefire way to get rich quickly, without putting in the hard work or expertise required for other forms of investment. This belief was fueled by a boom in the stock market in the years leading up to the crash, which led many people to invest in stocks without fully understanding the risks or doing their due diligence. When the market began to decline in the fall of 1929, Many investors panicked and started selling off their shares, causing a chain reaction that eventually led to the crash. This story illustrates how our beliefs and attitudes about money can have a powerful impact on our financial decisions and outcomes. The belief in easy money led many people to take on risky investments without fully understanding the potential downsides and ultimately contributed to a major financial disaster. On the other hand, a healthy money mindset involves recognizing the importance of hard work, education, and careful planning when it comes to building wealth. By approaching money with a sense of realism and responsibility, we can avoid falling prey to unrealistic beliefs or quick-fix schemes and make decisions that will lead to long-term financial success. Our relationship with money is shaped by many factors, including our upbringing, culture, and personal experiences. It's important to recognize that money is not just a financial tool, but also a deeply emotional one. Our emotions, beliefs, and values can impact how we approach money and financial decisions. One common belief that can affect our financial success is the idea that money is scarce or that there's never enough. This scarcity mindset can lead to fear, anxiety, and a reluctance to take risks or invest in the future. On the other hand, an abundance mindset recognizes that there's plenty of money and opportunities out there, and that we can create wealth and abundance for ourselves and others. Another attitude that can impact our financial success is our relationship with debt. Many people see debt as a negative thing, something to be avoided at all costs. However, debt can also be a useful tool for achieving our goals and building wealth. The key is to use debt wisely and responsibly, and to make sure we're not taking on more debt than we can handle. A healthy money mindset also involves being comfortable with money and wealth. Some people feel guilty or ashamed about having money, or they may have negative associations with wealthy people. This can lead to self-sabotage or a reluctance to pursue financial success. It's important to recognize that money is neither good nor bad in itself, it's what we do with it that matters. So how can we cultivate a healthy money mindset? The following are a few tips that you and your family can apply. First, become aware of your beliefs and attitudes about money. Notice any negative or limiting thoughts that come up, and challenge them with positive, empowering ones. Second, focus on the opportunities and abundance that exist in the world. Instead of dwelling on scarcity or lack, look for ways to create value and generate income. Third, educate yourself about personal finance and money management. Learn about investing, budgeting, and building wealth. The more knowledge and skills you have, the more confident you'll be in your financial decisions. Fourth, practice gratitude and generosity. Appreciate what you have and give back to others. This can help shift your focus from scarcity to abundance and create positive energy around money. Fifth, set clear financial goals and create a plan for achieving them. This can help you stay focused and motivated and make sure you're making progress toward your desired financial future. Sixth, be willing to take calculated risks. Building wealth often involves taking some risks, whether it's investing in the stock market, starting a business, or buying real estate. Of course, it's important to do your due diligence and weigh the potential risks and rewards carefully. Seventh, practice self-care and stress management. Financial stress can take a toll on your mental and physical health, so it's important to prioritize self-care activities like exercise, meditation, or spending time with loved ones. Eighth, stay flexible and adaptable. The world of finance and investing is constantly changing, 
so it's important to stay open to new ideas and strategies. Don't get stuck in old patterns or beliefs that may no longer serve you. Hey friends, if you are enjoying this video consider subscribing and turning on the notification bell to receive a notification whenever I post a new video. Ninth, learn from your mistakes and failures. Financial setbacks are inevitable, but they can also be valuable learning opportunities. Take the time to reflect on what went wrong and use that knowledge to make better decisions in the future. Surround yourself with positive influences, whether that's friends, mentors, or books and podcasts. Seek out people who have a healthy and empowering relationship with money and learn from their example. And finally, stay humble and keep learning. No matter how successful you become, there's always more to learn about money and finance. Stay curious, seek out new information and perspectives, and never stop growing and evolving. Our beliefs and attitudes about money can have a powerful impact on our financial success. By cultivating a healthy money mindset, we can overcome limiting beliefs, embrace abundance and opportunities, and create a prosperous future for ourselves and our families. By following these tips, you can cultivate a healthy and empowering relationship with money that will serve you well for years to come. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.